Welcome back guys. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a brand new YouTube channel step by step if you are a complete beginner. From setting up your account to fine tuning key channel settings, ensuring nothing holds you back. This tutorial will guide you on optimizing your channel to its full potential. Yes, optimizing your channel from the start will increase your chances of being discovered by your target audience and grow your subscriber base. This is your host, Mohit from BloggerTech. If you're ready to improve your YouTube game, then open a new tab on your browser and let's get started. Our first step is to create a YouTube account. To create one, you have to go to gmail.com and have to sign up there for a business account. We all know that YouTube is the product of Google, so we have to create a professional Gmail account to create our YouTube channel. So let's walk through the process together. Head over to Google. There you can type Gmail and click on the first link to opengmail.com in a new tab. Once there, you'll see an option to create an account. Click on it to reveal a drop-down menu offering two options. One for creating a personal account and the other for a professional business account. For this tutorial, we'll opt for the professional account as it will enable us to create a professional email address, which can also help you in your YouTube journey. So click on For My Worker Business. Here, you'll get two options. One offers a paid address where you can obtain your professional account email with your company name along with some premium offers. However, for this tutorial, we're opting for the free option. While it's similar with this choice, you won't have the option to create an email address with your company name. For YouTube purposes, this is perfectly acceptable. Indeed, there's no requirement for a professional email to start your YouTube channel. Therefore, proceed with the second option. Now a pop-up will appear to create your account. Here you have to fill in your first and last name and click on Next. Now it will ask you for your basic information and it's really easy because you only have to fill out your personal details like your date of birth and gender. After filling in your details, you can move to the next step where we will create our Gmail address. Here you have to add your selected Gmail address or your name, but make sure to make it unique. Google will suggest you make it unique, and my personal tip is to add some digits or symbols to make your Gmail unique. After selecting your name, now you can go to the next step where you have to add your Gmail account password. And for the password, try to make it unique enough to be accessed only by you, not by hackers, by adding numbers in reverse order. Make sure to set your password mixed with characters, symbols and numbers. This way, you can ensure your YouTube channel will be secure from hackers. After setting your password, enter your phone number for verification. Use your personal number to receive the code directly on your phone. After providing your mobile number, Google will prompt you for the confirmation code like this. You'll receive this message on your mobile. Enter the code in the pop-up and click Next to complete the process. Here, it will now ask you for your recovery email to secure your account. So if you want, add your personal email here. And if you want to skip this step, you can simply click on the Skip button. After skipping, Google will ask you to confirm your entered details so far. So review them and click on the Next button. Here you can go through their Privacy and Terms page and just click on the I Agree button at the bottom of this page. After doing this, your Gmail account is successfully created. And now we can proceed to our second step of creating our YouTube channel. Our second step is to create a YouTube channel. Now open youtube.com in the same browser and go to the top right corner. Here, you can see that we are automatically logged into YouTube with our newly created Gmail account. Now we can proceed with our channel creation process. To create a new channel, you have to click on the Create a Channel button below your account, and this will bring up a pop-up where you can enter your channel name and channel handle. So, go with your desired channel name and handle. I'm creating this channel in the Make Money Online niche, so I'm setting a name related to that niche so that my audience can get an idea of what my channel is all about. This is just a demo for you guys, so make sure your name aligns with your channel content. After setting your channel name and handle, you can simply click on Create Channel, and this will successfully create your channel. YouTube will notify you with a message saying, your channel is being created, and prompt you to check back in a few moments. This process may take some time because we have newly created our email and YouTube account, so they will need to verify it. Now that we've successfully created our YouTube channel, we can navigate to our YouTube Creator Studio dashboard. You can go to your profile again, and you'll now see the YouTube Studio option there. Click on it, and boom. Congratulations, you are now logged into your YouTube Studio dashboard, where you can manage all of your content. With that, we can now move on to our next step, and our next step is to verify our YouTube channel. 
To verify our YouTube channel, we have to follow some steps again. Open your YouTube Studio dashboard, navigate to settings, and this will bring up a pop-up on your screen. Here, you have to go to the channel option and then navigate to the featured eligibility tab. Click on it, and this will display some verification options on the screen. Let's learn why verification is required after creating your channel. As you can see, we need to verify our channel to unlock these features. Yes, if you want to upload videos longer than 15 minutes, YouTube verification is required. This can also unlock other advanced features like adding custom thumbnails that we design ourselves, and the same goes for the live streaming feature too. Now to verify, you just have to click on verify phone number, and this will open a pop-up where you can add your phone number to verify your channel. Enter your number and then click on get code. You will receive a notification from YouTube with your code, and you can easily verify your channel to activate these advanced features. After verification, we are now left with the third option to verify, to enable some more advanced features. To activate these, we don't need to do anything. Yes, for these, YouTube will automatically activate or enable the third option after some more days if you make good history with your channel. For my channel, I just left it as it is. And here you can see that they successfully enabled these features automatically on my channel based on my channel history, so you don't have to worry about verification for these features. We only need the first two for starting our YouTube business. Now we are done with our verification process and we can run our YouTube channel freely. With that said, we can now move to our next step. And our next step is to optimize our channel for better visibility. So here we are on our channel dashboard. And to optimize our channel settings, we have to go to our channel settings again and select the channel option. Here, you will find a tab labeled Basic Info, and you have to fill in your country of residence in the first option. You can select your country of residence and try to add your genuine details because you may encounter errors or future problems when you apply for the YouTube Partner Program to make money from YouTube ads. So be genuine in all the steps. Now this is the most crucial part of optimizing our YouTube channel, where we can tell YouTube what our channel is all about. Yes, we are going to add our niche-specific keywords to indicate to YouTube that my channel belongs to this particular niche. As I mentioned earlier, my channel is in the Make Money Online niche, so I'm going to add some keywords related to that particular niche. You can add keywords specific to your niche. For example, if you're in the plant niche, then add all the keywords related to plants, growing plants, etc. Since I'm in the Make Money Online niche, I'll be adding my niche-specific keywords. After adding keywords, navigate to the Advanced Settings tab, where you'll find an option to specify if your channel targets kids. YouTube carefully distinguishes between content for children and a general audience. You must indicate this distinction. Choose from three options. For kid-oriented channels, select the first one. For general audience, the second. The third option is your choice. If you want to answer this question every time you publish a video, then you can checkmark the third option. These are the settings you can adjust to make your channel visible on Google and YouTube search engines. Now switch to the General tab and select your default currency. There are a lot of options to choose from, but my suggestion is to select the one according to your country. It's all your choice. You can also set it to default. Once adjusted, click Save to confirm. It's crucial to accurately define your channel's audience to ensure compliance and optimize reach. These are some essential settings that you should prioritize first for your YouTube channel. And yes, we are done with our basic settings. Now let's move to our next step, which is channel branding. Yes, we can now focus on channel branding, such as channel logos and banners. Today, we're going to create these using Canva for free. Yes, we're going to create logos and banners for our YouTube channel with a free Canva account, so you don't have to pay for creating your logos and banners. But before creating a logo and banner, we're going to add our channel description to the page so that our audience can better understand our channel. To add the bio of your channel, go to the customization option and switch to the basic info tab. Here, you can see your channel name and channel handle, which you can change every 14 days. So if you think you've chosen the wrong name for your channel, you can change it after 14 days. No need to worry about that. After these options, you'll see the channel description text box where you can add your channel description or bio. The basic rule is to tell your audience about you, your experience, or what you have accomplished so far with a small call to action to subscribe to your channel. Yes, you can introduce yourself, share your achievements, and explain how you achieved them so that your audience can relate to your journey personally. This will help you to get subscribers faster. For this tutorial, I am copy pasting my bio but you can follow this rule to grow your channel faster. Below your channel bio, 
you can see your channel URL. And this is your channel's unique identity on the internet now. For this tab, all the settings are done and you can move to our next step where we will design our channel logo and banner on Canva. To design a logo and banner, head over to Canva with your account. If you don't have one, sign up with your email and create your account. Canva is a great tool, but in the free plan, you have some restrictions. However, for banners and logos, we can design better with our creativity. So follow the steps with me. Here I am logged into my free account. Now go to the top right hand corner and search for YouTube logo. I'm trying to create this logo in Canva, which is only a three step process. Click on YouTube logo and this will open a new tab with our editing space. Now click on the white space and go to the color palette. From here, choose the orange color for the background. Now go to the elements tab and search for circle. Then switch to the graphics and choose the appropriate circle element for our design. For my design, I am going to choose this one. Edit the circle to fit the frame. You can expand and adjust its position to center it according to our logo. Again, go to the elements tab and search for man using laptop. Then select any graphic that you like for your logo. Since our channel niche is make money online, I'm choosing a graphic of someone holding a laptop. You can also experiment according to your niche. I already did some experiments and I came up with this logo. Now we can download it if we are ready with our design. Okay, now that we have downloaded our logo, we can focus on the banner. To create the banner, go to the home page and search for YouTube banner and click on it. This will open a blank page in a new tab. Here, you can copy and paste your character and adjust it according to your YouTube banner. For my banners, I use motivational quotes to make them professional. So I go to Google, search for money-related quotes, and choose one for my channel banner. I'm fast-forwarding the process, so you can watch me doing all this. Okay, the elements are now in place. We can add a background to our banner. Here I love to use a paper texture background for these types of banners. Go to elements and search for paper texture. Then choose the one that fits your banner vibe and add it to our design. Okay, our design looks good to go now. I can download it for my YouTube banner. Now go back to your channel customization dashboard and upload the logo and banner for your channel. For the banner, do the same. Click on Upload Banner, select your banner, test its visuals, and then just hit Done. For the video watermark, you can upload your logo PNG here, or you can simply leave it blank. Now hit Publish, and all the changes we made in our branding step will appear on our channel page. Here's the final look of our channel, and it looks amazing. Now we are done with our channel customization process, and this is all you have to do when creating a channel. If you are watching till now, then I can guarantee you that you have done everything right to get monetized by Google without having any issues from YouTube. As I previously said, you have to provide your genuine information, and that's all. No need to worry, just upload videos and make money with YouTube. In my next video, I will tell you the exact process of uploading a video to YouTube for search engine optimization so that you can get traffic from search engines too. So make sure to subscribe and press the notification bell so that you can get notifications. If you like this tutorial, then please comment your thoughts and recommendations on what you want next from me. I will make a full tutorial like this to explain each point to help you better understand about digital marketing. So comment your suggestions below. And if you want to know how to create a faceless video from scratch, like from keyword research to editing YouTube videos with Canva, then you can watch this tutorial.